Hello and welcome to Mildenhall for day two of the European Championship weekend. Today we're going to bring back our driver spotlight feature and focus on defending champion 5 on 5 Frankie Wayman Jr as he looks to keep those red and yellow checks on his roof. We're going to follow Frankie throughout the course of the meeting, the highs and the lows and see how he gets on. So as part of today's European Championship day two, as I said, we're going to be focusing on Frankie Raymond Jr. Frankie, you're defending the yes. red and yellow roof. Yep. Two day championship. Yep. How was last night? It was good. Yeah. It was good. Um, got a third, a ninth in the final, third in the Grand National. Uh, I got into the lead in the final, but we had an altercation with some parked cars just before the yellows. It caused a lot of damage on the front end, had the bumpers right around yeah. into the wheel. And I was <coughs> struggling to steer it, to be honest. Yeah. Uh, this is a bit of a shame, because I'm actually in the lead on the yellows and I'm, I was like, yeah, this, this yeah. is looking quite good. But yeah, we still managed to get a finish, which is important, good. you know, when you're trying to get the points to, to get up there for the European grid. Yeah, so the points from last night yeah. and then heats the today. Yeah, and then the heats yeah, and, then the, and then the grid yep. forms. So what, you're yeah. kind of top six at the minute, is that yeah, right? Yeah, 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 I think I'm six, yeah. yeah. As, as long as I'm in top five rows, I'm, yeah. I'm happy with that. Okay. So we've gone into European and obviously defending yep. it. Do you feel a bit more pressure, do you no. think? No, no, no not at all. Something asked me that yesterday. I, no. You know, I've, I've won four European Championships. I'm not, I'm not, I know I'm not going to win thousands more championships. I'm just here to try and win some yeah. and have a good time. That's why we're here, you know what I mean? Car had pace last night. I love building all track. Okay. It, you, you need the look. If you yeah. haven't got the look here, you, you yeah. might as well just stop it. It's pace. not a fast, it's not a no, fast no, speed no, track, is it? No, 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 it's just, it's just about cars hitting you yeah. in the wrong place, cars crashing in front of you, just reading the race, which I'm usually quite good at, so I can usually do all right. I won the final here, the last meeting we yeah. had here, um, and then obviously last night we got into the lead in the final, so yeah. we have got pace about us, so no, we're happy. So we're going to follow you after your heat, and uh, hopefully not the consolation, because that would be bad. I can't go in the consolation, no, 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 no. We're, no. We're, we're, we're actually in, in it, but yeah, so like, perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so we've done Bradford, we did Sheffield, and now Mildenhall. It's yeah. very different yeah. in terms of... 100%, yeah. every track. I say, you know, you can see with the top lads, they get dialed in, and I say, yeah, it's just one of them tracks. You either like the track or you don't. Yes. I've loved it. Yeah. You know, I raced back in 88, yeah. when we first started, when it first when we first come here, and everybody got in here like, Jesus, you won't get round that. No, but it's no. just, you, from one corner to the next, you don't have time to think, yeah. and you're constantly at it. You so know, on the bigger shale tracks, like yeah. in Kings Lynn, yeah. going down the straight, you've yeah. got a bit of time. Yeah. Not a lot, yeah. but you've got a little bit of time. Here, nothing. So how far ahead are you looking then? Oh, you, right around the next corner. Okay. Yeah, I'm not even looking down the next straight. It's right around the next corner, yeah. who's there, what they're doing, where they're yeah. crashing. And that, that's how you read it, you know, so, yeah. In terms of 2023, it's been a bit of a different season for yeah. you. Yeah, we've enjoyed it. Yeah. Um, so I've missed a few meetings. Yeah. Obviously, everybody's feeling it at the minute, trying to keep, get the cars going. We've managed to, we had a big week this week, getting Frankie's shield card on massive. It's the hours we've put into that. But I wanted to get him back out. Yeah. Managed to get his engine rebuilt and got him back out. And he had a good run last night, he was happy. You know, Frankie's happy if he just finishes races. And he was on the pace last good. night. You know, the second to Ryan in the consolation, which yeah. is, you know, it's not bad to be second yeah, to Ryan. No, so obviously, you know, he's, He's got pace about him and he's yeah. happy, so you know he's, he's getting stuck in half. Half feet, he's just out of the qualifying at the yeah. minute. But again, last night, I think it was consolation. She started 26th on the grid, just in front of yeah. Ryan. She finished sixth. And Round Milder, no, yeah. Round Milder, yeah. she loves it here. Yeah. She does like. She likes it in her V8. Yeah. But you know what? We're enjoying it. It's been good. Good. A new car. So we we spoke NEC yep. and we were like, it looks beautiful. Yeah. How, how have you found it? Has good. it been as good as you yeah. wanted to be? Yeah, it yeah. has, yeah. Every meeting I've been to, it's been there or thereabouts. Yeah. And, you know, we're still messing about with it. And obviously, we have teething problems. You have rooms of bad luck. I've had the good engines gone down again, okay. so I'm back to a spare engine I've borrowed. Just stuff like that. And it all throws into the mix, because then 30 hours, you have swapping the engine and getting it all ready, you're not progressing no. with the car. It's like and, a working week for somebody, oh, isn't it? It's, Do you it's know what unbelievable. Mean? It just, it's mad. I mean, this week, 
wheels. I had all the wheels and tyres for me and kids. Yeah. I must have done 35, 40 wheels and tyres, straightened them, straightened the rim. That sounds like up. fun. <laughs> it's just days and people don't see no, that. No. You know, there's hours and hours on a night just rimming yeah. wheels and tyres. Yeah. When you come for a weekend here, you need a lot of wheels yeah. and tyres. Fish has got three, yeah. four of you. Yeah. You know, and, 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 and that's what you've got to do. Yeah. But no, we, we're enjoying it, you Good. know. Like I said, uh, we came down Friday night. We just work till late and then drove through night. Yeah. Me, Sam and Phoebe come down, chilled out, really good run down. But I think that's what they want to, to do. Yeah, I yeah. think for the European, they've kind of got Dean's gone. We want a bit of a uh, yeah, relaxed 100%. social weekend, yeah. and it very much yeah, feels like that. For me, if I drove down Saturday morning, it'd yeah. be four and a half, five hours driving. Yeah. Then I've got to do the meeting. It's just. And I said to Sam and Phoebe, we're all right, coming Friday now. We set off about half eleven. We got here about four o'clock or yeah. something. But then into bed, straight yeah. sleep for a six, seven hours. Job done. Yeah. And perfect. we're up. We're here. Everything's relaxed. Our Frankie came down with Carl Deft because they were still working on his car, but yeah, yeah no, it was, it was good. And like I said, we enjoyed coming down Friday now with some music on and Phoebe singing all the way down. And it was good. Like a so. weekend away in Mildred. It, it's it, well, that's exactly what yeah. it is. That's Absolutely. what it's supposed to yeah, be. Yeah, yeah. And that's what the racing's supposed to be yeah. about. You know what I mean? There's no point going to meetings being stressed all the time. I mean, I still get stressed. <laughs> I get stressed because I want the kids to do well and yes. I want things right. And, yeah. and when they don't go, things don't go yeah. right, I do get stressed. Yeah, and it does annoy me. But you know, we're here, we're enjoying ourselves. All the kids have got a smile on their face and everybody's happy. I mean, it's just so, the heat this week. Well, this is my last question. So we did drive a spotlight with you at the Hednesford yeah. November last year. Cold, windy. Was it cold? It was cold. I remember being cold. Yes. Yeah, so and then is, we're here today. This is polar opposite. Polar opposite, yeah. isn't it? Yes. But how's it, like, me and Sam were talking about mm. impact on you as a driver. Yeah. It must be quite draining yeah, both physically is. and mentally. Because yeah. it's hot just stood here, but yeah. getting in a race car. Yeah, it is. You know, I mean, obviously the adrenaline, you get out and you, you just, Wet yeah. right through it. But obviously, you know, it, you just you get used to it. We did yeah. a Venra a few years ago where it, it was a bit warmer than this. Yeah. And that was, people were getting out of cars and nearly passing yeah, out. It was that warm. Yeah. But yeah, last night it was, I know, like today it's supposed to be warmer, isn't it? Yes. But yeah, it's I, I worry on the stoppages a little bit. Yes. If there's like long stoppages for drivers. Because like I say when you sat in the car, when you're racing, it's fine. Yeah. But obviously, when you sat there on a yellow, yeah. And you're all yeah, like, you can't do anything, you're just, you're just and, absolutely and ready to go. You kind of, uh, yeah. You know, I, I do feel for some of them yeah. like that, and well, all of us really, yeah. but yeah. Good. Yeah. Thank what you. What so we should do is have a yes. water break on a yellow. Yeah. And you should come on and fetch everybody a water. Well, like, with like a cheap, like in the cinemas. Like, like, yeah, yeah. That, I could do nine, that. Nine, nine. Yeah. That's it. I'll talk to Sophie. Do she it. might go with it. Fetch us all a water. <laughs> Thanks so much. We'll come after your heat. Yeah, yeah, we'll see how we get on. Perfect. Yeah. Thank you. Frank, you've just, oh, no. oh, no. <laughs> you've just been out for your yep. heat. Yep. It looked like you were going to win that. Yeah. Then Danny came along. Yeah. He was quick. He was quick, and obviously, these Europeans, you, you need the places. You do. Danny really needs a lot of points because yep. he's right at the bottom. I just need to finish. Obviously, Craig was on the middle, Ryan was on the middle. Yeah. You've got to watch these things. Yep. So I didn't want to get embroiled with him, to be honest. Yep. Um, had a little bit of an issue. I think one of his shockers went off halfway through as well. but. I was kind of happy where I was. Yeah, yeah. If that yeah. makes sense. It's yeah. the wrong thing to say, but you're racing for points in that. You're racing for yeah, points. Yeah, aren't yeah, yeah. And obviously, Danny's not going to get to nowhere where we are. But obviously, I'm trying to get up to the yeah. front couple of rows. So yeah, that was good. <laughs> talk about you in a minute, Danny. While we talk about him, he's been doing well. The missions he's done. Yeah. He's seen proper on it this year. Yeah, yeah. He just gets such bad luck. They yeah. do. I ripped the car in bits last night. Smashed bits out. That's why he's so far down. But yeah. it's just racing. Just the nature of the track here, you know. So yeah. So it's hot, right? We know it's hot. Yes. You look very hot. Yes. Um, so the water in the track to begin with, yeah. it dries out. Yeah. It's coming on and watering it again. Yes. So how do you deal with that for the European? You've got to find the water, haven't you? You, see, you know, you find the dry line. Is that what you're looking for? Because yeah. you, you started, like, so you had the restart, you were inside, yeah. then you went outside. Depends where it waters it. And then obviously, like I said, uh, I didn't want to take myself out, spin myself around. Yeah. There wasn't that many cars running, really. And I, you're always conscious, you just yeah. need to keep going the right direction. You might not win, but just keep going the right yeah. direction. And obviously Danny found the dry line first yes. and went, and then obviously I found it and went with him, so yeah. When you set a car up, so normal, a normal shell meeting, wet at the start of a race, yeah. dries out, doesn't it? Yeah. So you can settle for wet or dry, can't you, pretty yeah. much. So how are you going to do or that? Or intermediate your... or both, yeah, you, you compromise a bit one so way So what are you going to do? Well, you've kind of got to a little bit here, because if, you, if you're not, not moving first couple of laps, yeah. you're not going to be finishing. Yeah. That's the problem. You've got to survive and be in control of the first few laps, yeah. I think. Um, you know, it's all right setting a car up for the slick right at the end, yeah. but if you're a sitting duck at the beginning, yeah. you might not be running at the end, so what's the point? Yeah. You, can, you know, it, if, my theory is, if you, if, you, if you get gone 
at the end you can get your elbows out. When you're racing and it's yeah. then it's dried up and you're racing, that's totally different, you know yeah. what I mean? You can race a race. But so have you beginning. decided what you're going to do now? No. You, no. <laughs> You've got a bit of time. Depends where I am. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I, I, I'm, yeah, I'm happy where I am roughly. Yeah. I'm, you know, it's good in the wet. He seems to have a bit of pace in yeah. the dry. I, you know, it's just going to be surviving them first few laps, I think. So looking at the kind of the grid, I guess yeah. no surprise, you've got Matt, Lee, Tom, Craig, all up there. Yeah. Ryan's had a bit of bad luck in that one again, yeah, like again, last yeah, night. So he'll be down a bit so again. Be down again yeah. So are you kind of going, like Craig's my concern, or is it just all of them? Is there anybody? It's, just, it's all of them, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no quick car here. Yeah. yeah, you know, Craig's normally quick on shale, but here it's just everybody's yeah. pretty much of a much of him. Like in the final last night, Matt, we all went in, Matt got away and he was gone and he won it. Yeah. It probably wasn't the quickest car, Craig probably was, or, yeah. or Paul the Irison even yeah. last night. But because Matt made the break and gone, and that that's my my wife than the European. Bro. It seems to get a bit like that, because we talk about Sheffield as being that like once once, once you spread, spread out, out, spread yeah, out. Yeah, but yeah. here it seems a little bit like that today as well, yeah. once you kinda of get a few cars yeah, and you can get gone, but then obviously if you have a yellow, bunches back up. Bunches it back up and you ride on them again. So you know it, it's yeah, it's gonna be one of them. Flat tires, just yeah. last question. There's been a few flat tires. Yeah. Is that because there is that bit of a ridge and on the fence? On, yeah. Oh, okay. Is that yeah, what's doing yeah. it? Frankie got one in first one. Yeah. Tom turned him into a wall halfway down straight and he yeah. just pierced his tyre. Okay. It's just one of them, unfortunately. I see you've, you've kind of got to drive with that in your mind a little bit. Yeah. Y yeah, you might lose a couple of places, but you need to keep your wheels on your yes. car. Yeah, of course. When you're on the middle, otherwise, yeah. you know what I mean? It, it's no point being there if, you, if you've got flat tyres. Yeah. So, going into European, which is next yeah. race, for Constellation, then European. We're going to be like top three rows, we're thinking. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I was third row before yeah. that, so, so I had a second then. So whether I've gone inside or I might have even sneaked onto the second row, I don't know. Comfortable, uh, confident. I'm happy there, yeah. No, no, no. We'll have a race of it, can't we? Now, yeah. and, you know, I like to be in the mix, you yeah. know, I'm, and we'll, we'll, we'll see what goes on. But we'll come and talk to you after, and hopefully, I'll have a trophy back. You'll have a trophy back? Yeah. That'd the be nice. one with the first, the first one, yeah, the not, first not second or third one, the first one. That'd be good. On time this yes, year. Yeah. On time this year. <laughs> Yes, because I, do you know when I was driving here today, I was like thinking about last year's European, and I, was, I thought, yeah, there was that whole, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. 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 It's not the way to win a championship. No. You don't get the glory from any part of it. Yeah, you're in the top three on the day, but that was it. And yeah, it, yeah it's one of them. But you know, hopefully today we'll have an out and out race. We need to have a good race. Yes. You know, there's, there's a lot of us up there, six or eight, yeah. real quick cars, and then everybody else is right behind them. Yeah. Could be anybody. And the, and the crowd, it's a very big, I've never seen a, a crowd as big as this. Yeah, no, no, it's a huge crowd today. Big weekend, yeah. good racing, two, sal two yeah. saloons, good Europeans. Yeah. And us, I think it's, I think it's worked real well, yeah. you know. Uh, the change from Northampton, got yes. it down here, and obviously the, the racing here, it's always good. Yeah. You don't need a lot of cars. We weren't sure what sort of car figure we were no, going to get. No, Really happy with 64, yeah. you know, 10 or 11 Dutch, really good. Yeah, it's it's been a weekend of it, and you know, everybody's enjoyed the atmosphere, it's been absolutely brilliant all yeah. weekend. You know, a big thank you to Dean Wood and his crew. You know, they put a good track on. I talked to Dean last night when they were working the track. They put a lot of hours into it again last night. Yeah, he's, he's not stopped, has he? No, he's no. Not and, he, and he has. He's given us a track to, to race yeah. on. I mean, look at this, this heat. Yeah. You know, any shale track shouldn't survive in this. And we haven't had nothing. No, dusted, there's, there's no dust at all, you know, is And he's got to water it, he has. Yeah. Everybody moans and cries, but you've got to. You can't just have a dust fest. It yeah. just, you know, yeah, the first heat was a bit wet, but it was the same for everybody. It's yeah. not an issue. But he's got to keep that track right. Yeah. You know, and he's doing a good job, and I think the racing's been super. Yeah. I think, so he's two and three, like you say. It kind of dried a bit. Dried a bit. Yeah, yeah, but like heat one was wet, yeah. but whoever's in it, whoever was in it was in it. You know, yeah. that it wasn't any particular reason, just the first F1 yeah. race. So, but no, the, the crew's done a good job of the track, it's been good. Good. Good luck to you, up here. Thank you very much. Frank, we thought we'd come to a nice, tranquil, cool place. We've just had the European. Yes. It, it was, um, I thought you were going to win it. And then you, it was just, it was a very entertaining yes. race. Proper Do you race. Do you talk us through it, like, well, from your perspective? As a defending champion, yep. you want to have a say in what's happening. You do. You want to be there, you want to be leading. And I was. Yeah. You know what I mean? I, it's always that choice, that tyre choice. I mean, Tom got away a little bit, then spun himself on it a is. wet bit. Yeah. It's so hard when it's like that. And then a few laps later, I did it with yeah. it down at the other end. It's just so hard because you're pushing and you're pushing. When yeah. Tom did it, I'm like, don't do that, Tom, yeah. normally. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm like, yeah. I thought, come on. And then I got going and I was good. And then there was another yeller and it just broke my rhythm a little bit. But no, 
And then obviously I sat on the yellers. I'm leading, Tom second, looking back, so he was, and Frankie was third. Yes. And I'm like, I don't remember lapping him. No. He's actually third, because he sat at the back. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, right, okay, yeah, come on then, let's, let's go. And anyway, he ended up fourth after all, but he, he drove a superb race. Yeah. Like, and Danny got third bit to the end, yeah. so. It was, for me, for, from a spectator, it, was, it had everything. I mean, yeah. you've got like, your first restart, Matt's leading. And pulls off before we Whoa, get going. It's, like, like, it's just, just a bad luck, isn't it? Matt Newsom yet again. You're in the lead, and then Tom likes eight spins, and you've got like a straight, and, and you're like, this is it. And you, then it you, closes again, and that's just stock car racing. Yeah. But to be in amongst it, yes. you can't ask for more than that. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I got a flat on it, like cocked up with Liam. Just, when it gets so slick and it's yeah. so sideways, it's hard. I just caught him with right front. It seems to slow down. The racing almost seems to yeah, slow it down. Yeah, it does because nobody can go anywhere. Then yeah. I was watching Frankie and Bobby at the end. And obviously, Bobby cooked his tyres. Yeah. Frankie got him on the last straight, but Bobby sort of waited for him and cocked them both up a bit. And then Danny nicked through and out. And Frankie ended up fourth again. So, yeah. but no, he, he, he's done a good weekend. He's done all right. So you know, you, you seem quite happy. In yeah, the sense I'd of like to say that you if are. you can come and have a weekend, yeah. be part of it. Yeah. Be on the pace, battling with Tom. Stock car racing, stock car racing. You know what I mean? It's, it's what Tom might have, like not even got going where he spun himself out. It, you just haven't got a clue. It's just one of them. But you know what I mean? For somebody to come and just clean up and take it away, it's not what fans no, want to see. No, You know, there's quite a few fans that probably want to see Matt win it because he's, you know, he's drove well all weekend. It was very interesting because I sort of watched past a load of people and they're all, they're, you know, before the race started, everybody was kind of going, you could hear the murmuring, yeah. you're going to be mad, you're going to be Frank, yeah. it's, you know, no. generated. I mean, listen, hey, I'm not, I'm yeah. not saying after, on that restart, we're going to get an easy first corner, because he wasn't. Yeah. You know what I mean? I've, I came to win it, I'm not going to fucking yeah. mess about, <laughs> but you know what I mean? I'm the bad luck of it, I'm pushing him, lock back wheels up, straight away, and Matt look, never gets it in wrong gear when I'm like, that's yeah. locked up. Yeah. Oh God, so yeah. what do you have to do, no, do you know? know? No, no, don't know. Well, hey. But a great, a great race, and I think kind of it's almost brought the weekend to a close. It's been a yeah, great weekend. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I mean, you know, you couldn't ask for a more worthy winner. Yeah. Done his job. He hasn't been the fastest car all weekend no. by a long way. He hasn't blitzed everything. He's just raced with his head, and you know, he makes mistakes like we all do, and it's stock car racing. But that's the thing, though, isn't it? Like you've got two of the you know best drivers on the grid yeah. making mistakes. It's yes. like, <laughs> yeah, but when Tom did, I'm like, whoa, what's going on? Well, just the, the bit on the track, you've got a real drive it, and then he, he he nearly lost it completely. Yeah. He said on the on a wet bit, and you know, it's just how it is. But that's just stock car racing. Thank you so much for taking time out to talk to Absolutely today. no problem. Um, and it's, it's brilliant that you kind of still got a smile on your face. Yeah, no, hey, we always do. You know what I mean? We've got a, a top three. Our Dan was the Does third. Frankie yeah. fourth. Good weekend. So. Well, pick Danny out right at the beginning. Was Danny's doing my eyes. Yeah, you know, right? he, he comes on at the end of the race. I say Frankie drove really yeah. good. His first weekend back on shale, so I'm really chuffed for him. So that's been good. Thank you very much for your time. Are you ready? Big smile. Again, Zachary. Smile. Look at you. That's it. Hi there. Hi there. So that brings our driver spotlight to an end. Tom Harris is the 2023 European champion.